the reason that I started out with C A G D that order, besides caged being something that's easy to remember, that is the order that if you file the chords up the neck, that's the order that the forms go in. If I start with a C chord down here, the root for C is this, right? Okay. So what other chord form uses the root on the A string? The A form does. So if I substitute right here, use the A form, or if you want to play it this way. So this would be C chord also. C. So the C form, A form. Now, where else is a root in this chord? Right here. What other chord form uses a root on the G string? The G form. So that would be G form, C form, A form, G form. Okay, now what root uses? Here we have a root here on the E and on the E. So what chord form uses the root on the E? The E form. Another C chord right here. So we have C, A form, G form, E form. Now what root? Root on the D. Which chord form uses that? The D form, of course. So, so C form, A form, G form, E form, D form. All a C chord but the five different forms. They go in that order, C, A, G, E, D. So say if I started from G, the next step up, the next form I could use would be E. The next form would be D, the D form. C form, and so on. C form. C A G E D. That is the order. And in future lessons, we're going to get into scale forms, which follow the same pattern.